In less than two years, the Del Mar Fairgrounds could become a place to bet on professional and college sports. Our ABC Tennis reporter John Horn explains the groundwork already being laid. Viewpoint Brewing Company sits just across the San Diego River from the Del Mar Fairgrounds. Brewery founder Charles Cole says horse racing helps bring him guests. When people want to go to Del Mar, they have to walk by us. But even as the Del Mar racetrack retains its prestige, a cloud hangs over the industry and that potential foot traffic. Betting handle has dropped 18% over the last decade statewide amid an overall decline of horse racing. That's one reason California voters next year will be asked to authorize sports gambling on tribal lands and via authorized racetrack operators, including the Del Mar Thoroughbred Club. The fairgrounds already has the facility. It's called Surfside Race Place, and you can go there now to bet on horse races taking place on other tracks. On Tuesday, the Del Mar Fair Board voted to allow sports wagering as part of its operating agreement with the Thoroughbred Club should voters approve the measure next year. That will give the club time to pursue a quote top tier operator to open a sports book at Surfside Race Place by early 2023. Then those 21 and over could bet on pro and college sports minus colleges based in California. So in total, sports wagering revenues will assist the district as it continues to recover from the economic effects of the pandemic and help provide for the district's long-term financial stability. Winnings would be taxed at 10% with some of that money going to enforcement and problem gambling programs. John Horn, ABC 10 News.